So first I'm going to be applying my L'Oreal True Match Luminous Foundation all over my face. Then I'm going to be applying my CoverGirl Stick Concealer in the shade Medium under my eyes to cover up my eye circles. Then I'm taking my Maybelline Fit Me Press Powder and my BB20 Bella Terra Large Kabuki Brush and applying that to my face. Then I'm taking my NYX Eyebrow Marker in the shade Medium and filling in my eyebrows. Well, I promise you. Then I'm taking my NYX eyeshadow primer and applying that to my eyelids. And taking the Julep eyeshadow in shade Moonbeam and my Bella Terra BB9 eyeshadow brush and applying that to my lid. Then I'm going to be taking the Periwinkle color from the Revlon Wild Orchids eyeshadow palette and applying it with the same brush in my inner corner. Then I'm going to curl my lashes with my NYC eyelash curler. And now I am taking my Maybelline Great Lash Transparent Mascara and putting this mascara on because it just gives a lighter, more subtle look, and I like it. Then I am taking my CoverGirl lip liner and overlining my lips to obviously make them fuller, and yes, I am overlining my lips. So this is more of the natural way instead of using that little um, lip plumper device thing because I tried that out and I have no idea how it even works, and plus you have to order it and go through all that stuff, so overlining your lips and... Then, overlining the corners of your mouth, too, is very important to succeed with this tip thing. Well, I promise you. Then, lip gloss is honestly the best way, at least for me, to make my lips fuller versus, like, a shimmery lipstick or anything like that. And so I'm taking my Catrice Nude Lip Gloss, and that is this video. And I hope you guys enjoyed and that you learned something. And bye, I love y'all.